Welcome back to our channel, folks. Today, we're diving into a topic that affects many of us, tomatoes. Those juicy, red fruits, or vegetables, depending on who you ask, are a staple in kitchens worldwide. But did you know that for some individuals, indulging in tomatoes can lead to unexpected consequences? That's right, we're talking about people with health conditions who shouldn't consume tomatoes, exploring their side effects. Let's kick things off by discussing tomato allergies. Now, they might be rare, but they can pack quite a punch. When certain proteins in tomatoes trigger your immune system, it is not a pleasant experience. Think rashes, itching, hives and in extreme cases, anaphylaxis. Tomatoes, with their natural acidity, can turn up the heat on your symptoms. If you're dealing with GERD, you'll want to pay close attention. Tomatoes, with their natural acidity, can turn up the heat on your symptoms. Heartburn, chest pain, and acid reflux? Not exactly the tomato experience you were hoping for. Moving on to kidney stones, nobody wants those. But did you know tomatoes contain oxalates, those little compounds that can team up with calcium to create these painful stones? If you're prone to kidney stones, you might want to rethink your tomato intake. And now, let's chat about high blood pressure. Sodium is a notorious culprit, and guess where you can find it in high quantities? Yep, canned tomato products. So, if you're keeping an eye on your blood pressure, consider cutting back on the canned sauces and soups. Arthritis sufferers, listen up. Some folks with arthritis have reported that tomatoes worsen their joint pain. While the science isn't crystal clear, it's worth monitoring your body's signals and possibly reducing your tomato intake if it's causing discomfort. Now, let's talk about lycopene, that antioxidant superhero found in tomatoes. But here's the twist, some studies hint that too much lycopene might not be a hero for your prostate. If you have prostate issues or a family history of problems, consider chatting with your healthcare provider about your tomato habits. Migraine sufferers, heads up! Tomatoes contain histamines that can be a migraine trigger for some. If you're prone to these throbbing headaches, it might be time to keep an eye on your tomato consumption. Lastly, we've got diabetes on our radar. Tomato-based sauces often sneak in added sugars. And guess what those sugars can do? Spike your blood sugar levels. So, if you're managing diabetes, scrutinize those food labels and opt for tomato products with little to no added sugar. In conclusion, while tomatoes are a fantastic addition to many diets, they're not a one-size-fits-all food. People with specific health conditions, including allergies, GERT, kidney stones, high blood pressure, arthritis, prostate issues, migraines, and diabetes, should tread carefully when it comes to tomatoes. Understanding these potential side effects and paying attention to your body's signals will help you make informed dietary choices. But hey, we know you might have some burning questions. So, let's tackle a few frequently asked questions. Can tomatoes cause allergies? Absolutely. Some folks can develop allergic reactions to tomatoes, leading to symptoms like skin rashes and itching. Are tomatoes safe for people with GERT? Unfortunately not. Tomatoes are acidic and can make GERT symptoms worse. If you're dealing with GERT, it's best to limit your tomato consumption. Can tomatoes contribute to kidney stones? Yes, indeed. Tomatoes contain oxalates that can increase the risk of kidney stone formation in susceptible individuals. Do tomatoes affect blood pressure? They sure can. Canned tomato products with high sodium content can raise blood pressure levels, especially in folks with hypertension. Are tomatoes linked to prostate health issues? Some studies hint at it. Excessive lycopene from tomatoes might have adverse effects on prostate health, especially if you already have prostate problems. And there you have it, folks. The lowdown on why some folks should be cautious around tomatoes. Remember, it's all about knowing your body and making choices that keep you feeling your best. Thanks for tuning in, and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for more informative content. Until next time, take care.